actions to be taken immediately after birthing. After the vessel has birthed, safe access to vessels should be set immediately. Ensure the safe access of persons boarding the vessel. Set safety ropes on the gangway and auxiliary ladder below the shore ladder if necessary. Deck duty must attend to visitors and ensure their safety when they board the vessel. Request for their identification card if any and check their names against the visitors list which is provided by the company in advance. Ask the visitors to record their name and signature on the visitors logbook. Visitors not listed in the list must be reported to the duty officer. Set fire wire as required by terminal. Maintain the height from the sea within the range. If the vessel is in a Japanese port, display appropriate signals as required by Japanese port regulations. Two black cylinder shapes in daytime and green flashing light at night to indicate that the ship is a huge vessel, according to Japan Maritime Traffic Safety Law. First, substitute over the B flag during daytime or flashing red light at night to indicate dangerous cargo, according to Japan Maritime Traffic Safety Law. When vessel enters Japan waterway such as Uraga Suido, Irago Suido, Akashi Kaikyo, Bisan Sito East, and Mitsushima Suido, display necessary signals as required by Japanese maritime traffic safety law. To show that the ship is handling dangerous cargo and undergoing cow operation, display cautionary banners on the deck handrail near the manifold on seaside. If the vessel does not possess such banners, it should borrow them from the local agent in advance. Signs to indicate safety passage should be clearly visible for visitors going on board. Ventilation control should be carried out as per close-down plan upon berthing at terminal. This is to prevent the intake of flammable gases into accommodation spaces. Designate only one access door for accommodation space on the second level above deck at the opposite side of the manifold connection. This is to limit access point to outside due to ventilation control and for security reasons.